So the pressure is now on for Coach Sean Wallace, who will take the lead for now. But his family tells our Perry Robinson that this is about much more than just winning a game. Perry. That's right, guys. Sean Wallace and his team face a tough test ahead, but his supporters believe a different battle has prepared him for this moment. Sean Wallace is no stranger to adversity, but his latest challenge is a bit different and unexpected. I definitely think that is bittersweet. Alert! Alert! Oh ah. Wallace will replace Eric Dooley as the acting head coach for Southern ahead of next week's Bayou Classic. But what makes this moment unique is Wallace's fight off the field. Wallace was diagnosed with stage four pancreatic cancer last month and is undergoing chemotherapy. Despite his challenges, his top goal now is to beat Grambling. When he first got diagnosed, he was like, I'm going to be there for you all every step of the way. And that made me really emotional because he was sitting from a hospital bed telling them, like, you know, it's okay. I'm going to be there for you all every step of the way. And this is the last step of the season for them is this big game. Hey, hey, have we played anybody yet? Have we played anybody yet? The defensive coach will call plays and possibly have a chance to win the same game he won almost 30 years ago. He played in the Bayou Classic and won MVP. Uh, they won Bayou Classic while he was a member of the team. And so just to see it come full circle at the 50th anniversary of this game, um, that means so much to so many of us. And as his daughter reflected on what a win could mean for their family, Coach Wallace walked in the room, covered in rain and fresh from practice. He told us he's ready. He's going to win this battle. He's going to win this battle on the field as well. Well, Coach Wallace was not able to give us an interview today, but his daughter did tell us yesterday was his birthday. If you would like to support Wallace and his fight against cancer, you can donate by finding this story on the 9 News app. Guys, back to you. Support his fight and a happy birthday to that man indeed. Thank you very much, Perry. Appreciate that. Thank you, Kevin, as well.